Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Bonnie the E-Mom. My channel is about reviewing various mommy products, um, baby products, and also products for older children. I hope that my channel will provide information to help other moms make easier decisions. Today, I will be reviewing the Jujubee Be Sporty diaper bag. It's actually a backpack style diaper bag, and I have it packed up for either a baby or a toddler under two years old. So I'm going to jump right in and um, show you the features of this diaper bag and also how I um, organize the diaper bag internally. So starting off with the front pocket, there's a zipper pocket here and inside I have my keys. And this pocket is quite deep. It covers my entire palm just to give you an idea how deep it is. And in this pocket here, which we call the mommy pocket, there is a front slip pocket, um, the main compartment, and also a zipper pocket at the back. So in the front here, I have a hand sanitizer. I have packed a reusable bag in case I need to stop by the grocery store. And the front pocket is separated by a mesh panel and it's elasticized, so it's stretchy. There's two small pouches inside. These pouches are by Jujubee as well. It's part of a set called B Set and it comes in three different sizes. Um, and this one is a small size. I use it as a wallet. I have a coin purse inside for change and cash. I have a card holder, which is called the Jujubee B Charge, just to hold my cards. And it has a D ring here, so you can actually strap one of the straps that comes with a B set onto it and hold it if you like to just carry your card case without the pouch. And this pouch is in the blush chromatics print. Here's another small pouch by Jujubee. And inside just has some mommy stuff like moisturizer, lip gloss, and chapstick. And there's the D-ring on the pouch to hook the short strap that comes with the B-sets and use it as a wristlet. In the back zipper pocket, I just have a pack of tissue. It's a pocket that's also great for flat, flatter things, but like for receipts. And if you pack the inside of the diaper bag full, it's gonna push against this pocket. So that's why I don't have a lot of things in the zipper pocket. But the mommy pocket is quite um, deep and wide, so you can even fit a long wallet like the Jujubee B Spendy or the B Rich. And just to give you an idea, there it sticks out about an inch out the mommy pocket. So it's actually a fairly big pocket to carry a lot of um, mommy items which I really, really like. So moving along to show you, this diaper bag has two side bottle pockets and they're quite tall. I have my son's water bottle here. It's a sippy version by Wow, one of our favorite brands. And it's a easy water bottle for him to drink from and it's leak proof and super easy to wash. I also want to show you a few other bottles that fit in this tall pocket. So the Dr. Brown's 250 milliliters baby bottle does fit inside. Also the Thermos brand Funtainer fits in as well with um, extra height to spare. I also have a large or a larger size Thermos bottle for myself. So. Mommies, if you want to bring a taller water bottle for yourself and put it in there, it does fit. I'll I will provide links to some of the baby pro baby products and mommy products that I use that you can still find on the market today in my description below in case you want to um, purchase any and use it in your own diaper bag. So on the other side of this pocket, I have a, well, I have a cute Dontella key fob here that I will tuck away tuck for a second away. These top uh, bottle pockets are great for packing other things that doesn't have to be a water bottle or a sippy bottle. 
it is also great for a snack tower. This one's by Replay. And sometimes I put a medium sized pouch in here or a long wallet or even my cell phone. So it's a great pocket to carry other things. And the diaper bag has D rings on each side. So you can hook your, um, your diaper bag to the stroller. But these D rings are also for a long messenger strap that comes with this diaper bag. So here is um, one of the straps that comes with this diaper bag. Um, this diaper bag comes with three straps, two for carrying it backpack style and one to hook it to each of the D-ring on the diaper bag and carry it crossbody or over your shoulder. This extra strap is great for um, using on other um, diaper bags that you have, like the B Light Tote, um, the GGB Hobo B, even on a B Quick. So I actually use this extra shoulder strap on a lot of my other diaper bags or um, bags that I have as well, whether by GGB or by another brand. And right here, um, oh, before I forget to tell you, these straps, um, all the straps are adjustable. These ones for carrying as a backpack style are actually removable. Both of them can be removable. So it's like a shorter strap that you maybe use on a hobo bee. And the great thing about these removable straps is that you could tuck them back in the back of the big slip pocket here. This is a deep slip, po slip pocket. And also attach the messenger strap on here as well so that you have two options to carry your bag, either as over your shoulder or as a backpack. So I like to keep both straps on me so that I can interchange how I carry this bag. I'm just gonna take this off for now. So here is a very deep slip pocket that goes all the way to the bottom of the bag. And it actually came with a light change pad here that fits in that slip pocket. And this is a small change pad that is mach machine washable and it's a great size for the infant stage. And inside here I have a book. So it makes a great pouch for putting activity items for your children. So I just have a little one of these books that have flaps to entertain my son. Um, I also have a tech pocket or I want to show you a tech pocket here in the back of the diaper bag which fits a size of phone like the Google Pixel 2 that I have. I'm filming with my phone right now so I'm just using this case to show you how big. It could fit horizontally down or vertically down or even horizontally. And it has this black soft fabric that lines a pocket for your tech items. Maybe even a point and shoot camera can fit in here. And it fits all the way up to above my wrist, just to show you how deep this pocket goes to. I don't know if you can see. This back slip pocket is a great catch-all pocket too, if you like to um, use that bag or use that pocket in a different manner. It has a really good strong grab handle in the same material as the straps, which is kind of like a seat belt, um, seat belt like material. This front flap is slightly padded and has magnetic closure and a single zipper bolt to open up the bag. In here on the top, I have a swaddle blanket, which you can use as a nursing cover as well. So let's see if I give you a glance at how I pack the inside. The prints that I use is um, the pink blush chromatic um, pouches, as well as I use the this purple print is called the Sakura at Dust print. So I have pouches in those two prints inside my diaper bag. Here I have a medium piece or set piece or medium pouch with extra clothing for my son and also a wet bag by Jujubee. This is called the Bee Dry. 
It's a super cute print with Sanrio and Tokidoki characters on it. It's really thin, so it's, it's easy to fold nicely, fit in your pouches. And it's machine washable. It has a snap closure so that you can hang this on your stroller if you need to. And then next I have a medium sized pouch with my son's feeding utensils, scissors, spoons, and also a bib. This is a Be Neat bib by Jujubee. It's really neat that it's reversible. It has a pouch to catch crumbs and drippings and a really strong magnetic closure. Next, I have a large pouch that carries some snacks for myself and a pouch for my son, pouches for my son. I also have this large pouch in the Sakura at Dust print, which has my son's diapering needs. So three diapers, um, a different change pad by 12 little I like this one because it's a lot longer my son is not in the infant stage anymore so this is a great size for him and it's slightly padded and easy to um, throw into the machine to wash and I also want to show that the large set piece or the B set um, comes with three pouches and two different size straps this one is the short strap I don't have the long strap on me in this video show you, but the long strap, you can clip it to the D-rings and make it a purse. So you can pull it out of your diaper bag and throw it over your shoulder or cross body to go. You can also use a short strap to create a grab handle, which I did earlier, or hook it to um, the D-rings or one of the D-rings and make it a wristlet. So like a clutch to carry to the bathroom. And inside here, I also have a Itsy Ritzy Wipes case. It has a 60 count package of wipes inside in the blush color. And it also has rose gold hardware, which goes nicely with this diaper bag. And this pocket is actually for the plastic flip tops. So a Pampers package of wipes, um, Huggies, and also Kirkland by Costco does fit in this wipes case and I want to show you how the organization or the pockets for organization looks like inside I know you can see in a close look this bag comes with um, I'm gonna flip it out to show you it comes with two slip pockets these mesh pockets which are fairly deep even a medium set pouch can fit in it, which I will show you. So if you want to put pouches inside these pockets, you totally can. It's a little hard for me to do <laughs> with it flipped out because it's quite flimsy. But I do want to show you that you can fit a medium set piece inside. And on the opposite side, there is a large slip pocket that is not divided like the other one. And it has a zipper pocket as well, which I have a small coin purse. It's my little med kit. And I have some band-aids and floss sticks inside. And that zipper pocket is great for also putting a small pouch. Uh, if you want to use small pouch as your wallet to keep it securely inside your diaper bag. So I'm just going to tuck everything back inside to inside the diaper bag and give you a final look at what this diaper bag looks like. So hopefully you get a good glimpse of this bag one more time. I hope you enjoyed my video today and that it provided you some useful information to help make you some help make your decisions easier in terms of what kind of 
um, items to pack in a sniper bag, how to use a sniper bag, and whether or not you want to purchase a sniper bag if you um, don't have one yet. And also give you ideas on um, how to use the different Jujube accessories with the sniper bag. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up for liking this video and also subscribe to my channel to follow me along for future videos. Don't forget to turn on the notification button as that will alert you of any new videos that I will upload in the coming weeks. Thank you very much. Have yourself a great day.